starts tomorrow approximately at 6 o'clock and I uh, look forward to uh, having, having him here and uh, taking, the next forward, uh, taking the next step forward and uh, continuing our journey here at the University of Miami to get to the top. How many years has he signed on for? What are the terms of the deal? We've agreed to a five-year agreement and being a private university we don't disclose other information. Kirby, what stood out uh, about him as opposed to other candidates? What set him apart? You know, the fact that he's been a head coach for five years. Uh, he has uh, learned, he's grown, he's developed, he's ready for that next step. He's ready to come to a program that can compete and win for national championships. He's an excellent communicator. He is uh, very organized, detail-oriented, and he's inspirational. He will inspire this football program to greatness. What's been the reception of the players once they were told? You know, it's, it's a tough period, right? It's, it's change for them. There are questions that they're uncertain about at this time, but I know tomorrow afternoon when they have a chance to meet Coach Golden, they'll be excited about the future. Was he the only guy you offered? He was. Mm -hmm. He was. One more question. In, um, I, do, do you worry at all? We always hear about Penn State, Penn State with him. I mean, he, he's a guy you think is there for the long term? We talked about that, and there's no doubt in my mind that uh, he will be the, the head coach at the University of Miami. Long term? Yes, long term. Long term. And ask him the question tomorrow and, and hear his response. But Hal Golden is very loyal and uh, he wants to be at the University of Miami. He wants to build this program back to the pinnacle of college football. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks for What did you say in the beginning?